Yo, what's going on, everyone? It's your boy D. Lloyd. So Sebastian Telfair, one of my favorite players growing up, because of course I seen the Through the Fire documentary. Sebastian Telfair in high school was incredible. His NBA career, however, it was solid, but really didn't live up to the expectations he had coming out of high school. Unfortunately, today I have to let you guys know that Sebastian Telfair has been convicted of gun charges in New York City. And he is facing 15 years in prison. So he goes in in June for sentencing. He pleaded not guilty. He was found guilty. And this is definitely a tough situation. Now, Sebastian Telfair, he was found to have three pistols, a semi-automatic ammunition, a bulletproof vest, and marijuana on him in New York, a place that is, you know, known for how tough they are with their gun laws you cannot be found with that type of stuff and he tried to beat the case he couldn't beat the case and now we have to wish that you know the judge is a little lenient on him Sebastian Telfair like I said his NBA career really didn't go the way I thought it was going to go he was still entertaining to watch I still ruled the form in the games that he did play good he had a couple of okay seasons um, but he's only 33 years old so 15 years, that's a lot, you know. And for Sebastian Telfair, who's already had a lot of family issues, a lot of things that really happened to him throughout his career, even his other, um, you know, missteps, I will say, this is definitely a tough blow and something that you don't want to hear or have to really talk about. But he is facing 15 years in prison. Um, like I said, Sebastian Telfair, as a kid for me, He's one of my favorite players, really because of that documentary. But after that, I really watched him through his career. And it really didn't turn out the way we expected. You would assume he would have still been playing in the league. Um, but he's no longer in the NBA. And this is definitely going to ruin any shot he has if he ever wanted to come back. But you guys let me know how you guys feel about this in the comment section below. 15 years in prison, potentially. Potentially. Hopefully he gets a lot less. Definitely a tough blow. But that's all I got. It's your boy D. Lloyd. I'm going to see y'all next time. Peace.